Hey guys, a real quick video here of uh, the contents of uh, the Descendants expansion for Fallen Land, a the post-apocalyptic board game published by Fallen Dominion uh, Studios. This is the uh, the big expansion for it. It comes in a big box that you can line all the cards up in. Um, it also comes with three decks of cards, uh, some mission cards, some more character cards. Um, there's probably some other cards in these in these decks. I haven't unwrapped them yet. But these are just cards to add to the cards that are in the base game. Uh, and then in this expansion, they add town events. I'm assuming this whole deck is probably town events. I do have another town event card I got as a uh, pr promo from Fallen Dominion Studios back in 20... Shit. 2014 or 15, maybe? Um, at Gen Con, uh, at Gen Con I went to a long time ago that um, there was a promo card there um, I got. But um, So you get some more cards to add to the base decks. Then you get these really nice dividers that you can add. You can line your cards up in that box there and then put these dividers in. Uh, and it's got your, you know, town events, spoils, and then all your encounters, planes, mountains, mission cards, everything. I hope they all fit in there, especially after they're sleeved, because I've sleeved all mine. Um, it also comes with a couple of punch boards. Um, it comes with some more town technologies, biodomes, and uh, some other tokens here. I'm not sure what they are. I haven't even looked at the rules yet. And then another punch board with another town technology. Well, it's more biodomes. So you get an extra town technology, and then I'm not sure what these other markers mean. Um, it also comes with in the, a bunch of these little, like, I don't know what these are, but they're they're bound up with some kind of clear. Let me get this. Can I get this apart without? Hold on. All right. What do we got? Rule cards. All right, this is explaining the extra rules that come in the expansion. Mostly it has to deal with the town deck. It's a new deck of cards that happens to your town. It looks like you get two of those. You can uh, pass... Yeah, you can pass these around. No, it's two separate cards. You only get one each. This is uh, card rule one. Uh, card rule one is basically just telling you Actually, what these tokens mean. Non-player character mercenary chips. Some link chips. Linked item bonuses. Okay. That comes in handy. Exclamation point chips. Use these to remind... Okay, some of these are just mnemonics. And it's just going over the different... It, this is basically just a quick rules explanation. It looks like uh, part two is really... Or, I mean, uh, the sentence rule card two is the one that actually details the uh, the town cards and, and such. So you get rule card one, rule card two. You get some more factions, it looks like. But these are on thin card stock. I seem to remember the base games... Might have been a little bit more thicker. I'm almost positive they were thicker, or maybe maybe these are the ones that came with it and they just changed them. I don't I don't remember. Angels of Mercy from Iowa City, Beasts of the Atom, Great Falls, Montana, and of course on the on the back of it it gives you a uh, little history of the faction, and what they believe in, what their motivations are. Battle Mountain. This looks like new ones. Maybe some of those other 
token. Well, I don't know. Maybe there's not enough. New separatists. None of these look familiar to me. These are in red. Sturgis. Oh, you know what? No, these are these are new. Prophets of Ezekiel, Neptune's Wrath on a big ass aircraft carrier, right? Sigma Complex. That looks cool. Centennials and the Collective. Yeah, some of these start in Ontario. Yeah, Mexico. But some of them start in, like, this one in Pennsylvania. Emporium, Pennsylvania. I know exactly where that is. Huh. That's interesting. But there's no... I, I don't know if maybe these um, can be used in place of certain... I mean, I guess they... Of course, why couldn't they be? But, man, they're really, th really thin. Ooh. Maybe it's just me, but I seem to remember the original ones had a lot more town upgrades. These only look like they have a couple. Maybe these are like some kind of minor factions or something. I, I, I don't know. I don't know, guys. I just opened it up. And, uh, let's see, we talked about that, that, that. Oh, and last but not least, they give you all these little these little trays, these little plastic trays, real thin. You've probably seen them a thousand times. A little lid for them. little real flimsy lid and some real. But you get two of these trays just for tokens. There's one, two, and then you get this other tray, I guess, for the, uh, the rounded tokens. But, uh, I probably won't be using these for that game because I've got all my tokens in these Plano boxes. See, there's the base game. These are all the base game cards and these. And uh, I got all my tokens in Plano boxes. So I won't be using them for this game. But anyway, that's a quick look at uh, the contents of Fallen Land Descendants expansion. Thanks, guys, for watching.